Hey everyone, it's Levi with my channel, Epilepsy and Me. Uh, just up uploading another video. It's been just a little while, uh, largely due to the transition from full dad mode to single guy mode. Uh, my daughter is spending some time with her mom. She lives in a different state. We've been doing this for about a year now, off and on for a month or two at a time. So, um, you know, this video is gonna be short and sweet for the most part. Uh, really, it just has to do with the transitions in life. Um, you know, not everyone's events in life are extremes, going from, you know, a dad to a single guy, or, you know, uh, you know, full life changes for the most part. Um, for me, it was a bit of a transition, um, I guess preparing for her to go spend time with her mom, you know, a couple of days leading up to it, realizing she's not gonna be with me 24 hours a day like she had for, you know, the previous two plus months to being, you know, a little on the lonely side. So, you know, sadness, kind of preparing for it, but not letting it be overwhelming. Um, and then kind of the shock, um, you know, as much as you prepare for that type of stuff, there's still that shock period. It took a couple of days to realize you don't have a four-year-old asking you questions all day. Um, you know, the house gets pretty quiet for the most part. So, you know, kind of dealing with that. Um, uh, try not to take it too hard um, and really trying to take advantage of this window of opportunity that I have. You know, always trying to look at things in a positive way. It's easier said than done, but uh, you know, I'd like to think that I've done a pretty good job with it. Currently, um, I think you guys were aware I was living in a town of 400. Uh, highly convenient as far as transportation goes. It takes about five minutes to walk uh, across town. Uh, the convenience of a small grocery store and a personal stress reliever at the gym at the high school. So, you know, as convenient as that was, um, I decided to take on uh, the big city life that Montana has to offer, uh, taking my uh, skills to Missoula, Montana, a population of just over 70,000, um, and uh, staying with a friend. Um, she's very supportive of me, and it's uh, very hard not to um, enjoy my time with her. So with that being said, like I said, just taking advantage of what I can during this little break period as a dad. Um, working out at the gym at the university is highly convenient. Um, trying hot yoga, uh, trying to connect with my spiritual side, um, which you know I'm really focusing on hopefully uh, just relieving that stress if I can't connect in that way. Now it is hot yoga, so uh, Maybe I'm taking it too quick because I am sweating pretty good through those processes, but uh, I am enjoying it for the most part. I will say one of the most convenient things about the bigger towns, the bigger cities, is transportation. Um, the bus system here is fantastic, you know, for a person that is very dependent on others to get from point A to point B. Uh, the bus is running most of the time, early morning till late at night, not 24 hours a day, but um, is there to um, do big things to little things. Um, I do have to keep an eye on the budget with all of the opportunities available. Um, you want to take advantage of all of it, but you kind of realize that um, you still have to keep uh, an extra eye on your budget. Um, another huge plus is my doctor is actually in Missoula, Montana. So, you know, I'm hoping with the next doctor's appointment, which is going to be in less than a week, maybe we can squeeze in just uh, an extra doctor's appointment uh, in between there, uh, make adjustments to medication, add one, lower one, whatever the case is. Um, I really like my doctor and just being uh, within rock throwing distance of his doctor's office um, really opens up the opportunity to attack this epilepsy at a in a, an aggressive way which is why I like my doctor for the most part um, now things that uh, change um, obviously Abby's not here but trying to take things uh, as positive as possible uh, easier said than done but um, Grocery shopping, uh, how I prepare food, um, just my daily routine. As much as I say I try to take advantage of everything, um, you end up with a lot of free time. You know, as much as free time as I thought I had to begin with, kind of just being a single dad at home. Um, 
having no one here, just me alone, um, it seems like a lot more free time. So uh, really trying to get my butt off the couch and uh, take advantage of what is cheap, what is free, and uh, not be a shut-in for the most part. So still having that drive, but keeping an eye on the budget. So there's that thin line that kind of comes along with it. Um, um, you know, I can't say it completely relates to other people's events in their lives. I'm sure transitions, events in their life aren't as big and, you know, some are bigger and how you prepare for that and, uh, you know, control it. If the word control can even exist, uh, you know, it takes practice and I don't feel like you'll ever be able to control the epilepsy to the full extent, um, especially when your triggers are stress, lack of street, uh, sleep, things of that nature. So I know that's specific to me. Um, you know, I hope the best for, for everyone else. If medications definitely kind of tying everything down and controlling it, fantastic. But for others that are having um, a harder time with it, control really doesn't seem to be in your vocabulary and I know that firsthand so you know with that being said it's the first couple of days of being here and um, you know I look to again control the budget while taking advantage of everything at all I'll try to keep you guys in the loop for the most part with um, you know daily events uh, maybe a couple uh, times out and really making sure that as much fun as I'm having I'm also keeping um, a close eye on on what those triggers um, could be turned on, you know, between the stress, between, you know, lack of sleep, things of that nature. So, um, again, thank you for listening, and uh, I hope the best for you. You guys can do this. Mm -hmm.